What's up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Alan. Alan again help you gain. Bitcoin is now weakening, and the descending channel is now coming up. And the uptrend line we talk about it in the previous video has been broken. But now Ethereum has hit a new high again, and Ethereum behaves better than Bitcoin. But it can't keep rising, so this is also a bear signal. So is Bitcoin now reversing? Will there be another crash next? In today's video, we will give you a detailed analysis of the Bitcoin and Ethereum market and share my trading plan. So if you don't want to miss any chance to win big, do subscribe to Code Infinite channel, turn on the notification bell to get the latest crypto trading strategies. Now, let's get started. First of all, keep in mind that we always start from the bigger picture to the smaller circuit. So let's look at the weekly chart first. Last week, Bitcoin closed a green candle with a upper week. The short supply appeared around 24k US dollars, and the closing price was about the highest price of this line. And there was also a large trading volume, which means that the rise has begun to show weakness. But the power to buy the rise has yet dried out, so there may still be a small rebound this week. And there may even be a new high. However, I still stick to my short orders because I think the weekly downtrend line is undergoing, and the consolidation has lasted a month or so. So there is also a chance for a new short trend. Let's shift to the daily level again. The price did not break through the bear flag after the price surge. It was still running inside and began a downward trend. In the short term, the price has fallen below the daily level support. It's 22k434. This is a short signal, and I shared my trading plan last week. So now I'm holding a short order around 22k707. I'm now having paper profit over 4,000 US dollars. Then the support below is the price near these two previous highs around 21k500. And the opening price of the second green candle is near around 20k791, which will form a good support. So if you long Bitcoin, it is better not to open orders now. Wait until the price falls to these supports before there's a rebound. Keep updates with the price and then go long at its perfect timing. It is too risky to go long now. The daily level does not give out a strong bull rising signal, so I will be more inclined to go short near the high level of 23k to 24k US dollars. The market is more volatile, and opening a short may introduce the impact of shorting, so be cautious. If you are long term shorter like me, you should continue hold firmly. Then, if my short trigger stop loose, we will go more details on the 4 hour level. This is the main cause here guys, if you don't have orders now, I will share where I think there is a chance to open short. Do stick around, it's very very important. It has begun to shape a structure of descending channel in 4 hours, and there are 3 places for effective verification. Therefore, my short order stop loss will be set around 24k 300 US dollars. Because there is still support below, it is possible that it will be rising again. In the short term, it is volatile and outline a falling structure. This is also the behavior of shocking. Because I'm now opening a long term order here, there is a lot of buffer with the stop loss line. Then, if the price does not break through the channel later, a short term downtrend will start forming, and we can open short near the upper line of the downtrend channel. At the same time, at today's daily level, the support becomes resistance. And then, the price go to short is probably around 22k500. You can pay attention to the chance and go short. Then there is another point that the price might fail and rose rapidly in the process of rising before. So this game here is fierce. So if you hear around 21k500 is broken, then let's look at the VPVR. Here is the blank area and the price fall to the price of the 20k791 pretty quick. 
so it's not easy to do long now. So the above is the technical analysis of the Bitcoin right now. Let's shift to Ethereum. The recent rise of Ethereum is stronger than Bitcoin because we can see that after the price broke through hovering box at the bottom below, the price hit a new high and there was no effective continued rise and it closed a long upper week after the hit on short with the trigger of stop loss. So now I'm holding a short order in Ethereum. The reason for that is the PL ratio still look very great and the risk of short term fluctuation is higher. So the short is not greatly levered. There is now a reversal structure similar to a triple top. The key is to fall below the key support of 14k80 before it can be established. The backtest resistance after falling below may be a good short selling chance. The short term profit target can be seen at upper edge. So the above is my trading plan and Bitcoin analysis. My opinions are for references only and not serve as investment advice. Crypto trading is very high risk, please be careful. Okay, I'm Alan. CoInfinite is a channel of crypto trading education. If you like my video and think it's helpful for you, do give us a like, share it, and turn on the notification bell. Make sure to subscribe CoInfinite. We will bring you a live broadcast if we hit a thousand subs. Alan again, help you gain. See you in the next video.